A nation's army is only as good as its weapons. The Indian armed forces face a daunting task. They defend vast borders and are up against various threats. Choosing the right rifle is crucial. It's about more than just firepower. It's about reliability and effectiveness in diverse combat situations. The Indian Army is currently undergoing a major modernization drive. Part of this modernization includes selecting new rifles for its soldiers. Two contenders have emerged, the AK-203 and the AK-74M. Both are formidable weapons, each with its own strengths and drawbacks. Understanding these is crucial for evaluating their suitability for the Indian context. The decision will shape the future of Indian firepower. The AK-203 represents the latest iteration of the legendary AK-47 platform. It's chambered for the powerful 7.62 by 39 mm cartridge. This gives it formidable stopping power. This rifle is well suited for close quarters combat. It excels in urban environments and jungle warfare, scenarios the Indian Army might face. The AK-203 is manufactured in India, ensuring a steady supply of weapons and ammunition and reducing reliance on foreign suppliers. The rifle is designed for durability and can withstand harsh conditions, a crucial factor for operations in diverse Indian terrains. Familiarity with the AK platform is another advantage, as Indian soldiers have long used variants of the AK-47. This eases the transition to the AK-203. The AK-74M is the modernized variant of the AK-74. It's chambered for the smaller 5.45 by 39 mm cartridge. This round offers less recoil, allowing for greater accuracy in sustained fire. The AK-74M is known for its controllability and is effective at longer ranges than the AK-203. The AK-74M features a folding stock, enhancing its portability, a valuable feature for soldiers operating from vehicles. It is also lighter than the AK-203, which can be advantageous for soldiers on long patrols. The Indian military has experience with the AK-74 platform as some units have used it in the past. This provides a degree of familiarity. Section 4 comparing the Titan's caliber to modularity. The choice between the AK-203 and AK-74M hinges on key differences. Caliber is a significant factor. The 7.62 Guabba 39mm of the AK-203 delivers more stopping power. The 5.45 IBA 39mm of the AK-74M offers better accuracy and less recoil. This makes it more controllable. Recoil management influences effective engagement. The AK-74M's lower recoil contributes to accuracy. This is crucial for hitting targets at longer distances. Ammunition capacity is comparable. Both rifles use 30-round magazines. Ergonomics and modularity are vital for the modern soldier. The AK-203 and AK-74M feature modern furniture. This includes rails for mounting accessories like sights and grips. This adaptability is essential in evolving combat scenarios. The choice depends on the intended role and tactical doctrine. Section 5. Logistics and Deployment Fueling the Front Lines Logistical considerations are crucial in evaluating these rifles. The AK-203, being manufactured in India, simplifies logistics. It ensures a consistent supply chain. This is vital for maintaining operational readiness. The AK-74M, if chosen, might need to be imported. This could create reliance on foreign suppliers. Deployment scenarios further complicate the choice. The AK-203's 7.62 carbat 39mm round is effective in close combat. This makes it suitable for jungle and urban warfare. The AK-74M's lighter weight and accuracy benefit longer engagements. This is advantageous in open terrain or mountainous regions. India's varied terrain demands versatility. The ideal choice might involve a combination of both rifles. Section 6. The Future of Indian Firepower both the AK-203 and AK-74M represent capable rifles. 
they offer distinct advantages. The decision on which weapon to adopt will shape the Indian Armed Forces' capabilities. The AK-203 provides raw stopping power. It is well suited for close quarters combat. It also benefits from domestic production. This ensures logistical simplicity. The AK-74M offers accuracy and controllability. This makes it effective at longer ranges. Its lighter weight is beneficial for soldiers on the move. A combination of both rifles might be the optimal solution. This would equip the Indian Armed Forces for a variety of combat scenarios. Ultimately, the choice reflects India's commitment to modernization. It prepares them to address evolving security challenges.